my thing. Do you know that in warm-ups, if you're going to have a day like that, like a starting pitcher or something? No. Uh, warm-ups, not really, but when I woke up this morning, I was feeling pretty dangerous. <laughs> Woke up feeling real dangerous. Yeah. Skip, that is the That's baker right. that we know and love. Yes, we do. Shannon, mm-hmm. how impressive was Baker yesterday? He played really well. Um, Go. If you look at it, he only had 20 attempts. He completed 17 of those. Um, but let's not minimize the run game because we saw that later that afternoon with mm. Zeke Elliott. Mm. You look at what Drew Brees did when he got were able to run for 244 yards. They ran for 211 yards on 29 carries, 7.3. They only had 50 plays. When you run the ball like that, mm-hmm. it's going to be hard to beat a team, Skip. And so what it did is it allowed him to, to – the play action was – I mean, the throw in the end zone was probably the toughest throw that he had to make. And it was a heck of a throw and a heck good. of a catch. Mm-hmm. But all the other stuff, Skip, the, uh, the Duke Johnson and the other touchdown the, uh, passes that he had, the guys were open. You saw it. I mean, the guy went, what, 14 or 14 in the first half? He had a perfect quarterback rating. Mm-hmm. And when you don't have to ask him to throw the ball 35, 40, mm-hmm. 50 times a game, I think you can have success, especially if you're going to run the ball like this. Mm-hmm. So let's, you know, throw it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Think about that, Skip. Baker threw the ball 20 times yesterday, 14 t- times fewer than any other start. Hmm. Hmm. You think that might be a coincidence, Jenny? I don't know. Hmm. So, so what are we going to do? Are we, so are we gonna, what about my homeboy Chubb Rock? Hmm. We going to talk about Chubb from the crib? Hmm. From the GA? From your crib? He from no, Georgia. Your crib. Anybody that that's from a big crib. Nah, in Georgia. Exactly. We claim all the homies. All of yeah, them. we claim them all. North right. Georgia, South Georgia, all of Georgia. Good to know. Yeah. But come on, Skip. Hmm? Like you tell me, Atlanta. Mm. Is that what we hanging at Atlanta? The defense. Where are they ranked defensively? They came in hot, man. They're 29th in scoring D, 30th in total D, 30th in pass D. Mm. Is that hot, Jeannie? That's hot. Like, Wait, does that mean my Cowboys have a shot this Sunday at Atlanta? Absolutely. Really? They look at, mm. they look at what... Hold so on. I'm going to predict you're going to try to predict they're going to win to jinx them. No. Am I right? I mean, uh, Ezekiel Elliott's on the plane like this here. Mm-hmm. Man, did you see what Chubb Rock did to mm-hmm. him? He got 170-something. Mm. Ooh, we I got, got a two. 92 all at once. I got two. Mm-hmm. I could get me at least two. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But, but give Zeke, him Zeke couldn't finish a 92-yard touchdown run. Oh. He was caught by Skip, Malcolm do Jenkins. Skip, stop. Now, you know good where Chubb is not out running no Zeke. I don't know. Boy, he you looked do pretty know. fast to me. Oh, Same guy who was in the airport on Hard Knocks, and nobody even knew it. who he was. No idea. Nick Chubb. And he was Baker's roommate during camp. and Maybe they would know think, him now. Yeah, I think they would know who Nick Chubb was. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So, I, I Skip, I gave him credit. I uh, thought he played well yesterday. They were able to run the football, and he didn't have to do anything spectacular. He didn't have to throw the ball 30-plus times. Mm-hmm. And for a rookie quarterback, this seems to be the recipe. Mm-hmm. Run the ball and put him in manageable D&D on third down okay. and make the throws easier. Mm. So give him credit. Give the offensive coordinator, whomever that mm. may be. I don't know his name since they relieved Todd Haley of his duty. But Baker played well yesterday, and they got the name win. Kitchens or what? He used to play quarterback yeah. in yeah. Alabama. Oh, that must have been many, many years ago. Many, many pounds ago also. But <laughs> yeah. oh, look at him. Look, skip on oh, yeah. <laughs> He kind of let himself go, but it's okay. He'll yeah. get it back. When you're around Baker, you'll get it back. No, you ain't get a skill. Yeah. You, know, you know how coaches, yeah. once they get heavy, yeah. ain't no turning back. I don't know. But that offensive line coach, I guess he's going to get it back, too. I don't think so. <laughs> Before the draft, Mr. Sharp sitting across from me said he favored Sam Darnold of these young quarterbacks. And I said, no, I'm sticking with Baker, and I would take him number one overall. And I give you the opportunity to say you give up and you're backing off and you're with Baker Mayfield. Mm-hmm. Will he be the best of the young quarterbacks in this crop? Yes, he will. You ready to give up? I mean, no. I think Skip, he's after, ready. Skip, after no. like eight, nine games, you want me to give up? Mm. So we saw the Ravens come in to Cleveland flying high at that point. They were hot. Boy, on defense, that was the number one defense in football at that point. And then the Falcons, obviously, offensively, they came in a hot football team. And Baker beat both of them. And Baker should have won the game at Oakland when Oakland still had a semblance of credibility at that point. Mm -hmm. He got robbed by a couple of calls, as we talked about. So he got his man, Rashard Higgins, back. That was his favorite camp receiver. And he finally came back 
from injury yesterday, mm -hmm. and it resulted in that play that we saw first and 10 at the 28 where Baker rolled out. And there, there aren't that many quarterbacks who can make that throw on the run because we had Hugh Jackson on the show last week, and mm -hmm. he said – He's really, he was highly impressed with his arm talent. Mm -hmm. He's got more arm talent than people give him credit for, and I would agree. And I love that line in the postgame media session mm -hmm. because Baker's got a little sarcasm to him. So a reporter asked about, did you know during warm-ups, it's like a baseball pitcher in your, yeah. your bullpen warm-up session, did you know you had it or didn't have it, you know, in warm-ups? He said, no, I, I woke up feeling a little dangerous. And then it went to pretty dangerous after that, real dangerous after that. And the point was, he was just having fun with the reporter. For sure. That's his spirit. That's contagious. That's his energy. That's his enthusiasm. That's his confidence that borders on cockiness because he can get a little, he'll push it right to the edge mm -hmm. and sometimes he'll get humbled, but he will jump right back up and sling it again. That's why I love this kid because he's got that thing. He's got that it factor. And to beat Ravens and Falcons at home, I, I think you can hang your helmet on those hey, what And what are both? Mm -hmm. challenged mm. in one aspect or other. The Ravens are really challenged offensively. The yep. Falcons are ooh, defensively skilled. And like I said, I said last week, if they could play a mm. teaspoonful of defense, mm. they could be a major player. They but could. they can't. They are what they are. This is who they are. And they, Matt Ryan has to be flawless. They have to be perfect every single week to give themselves a chance. Now, if you think the Patriots' defense mm -hmm. is bad, Falcons mm. is the king of bad defense. Okay. Maybe when Cowboys got a shot, I don't know. Yeah, but but you're gonna have to score. Yeah, and that's what and that's what you know. That's what they did. They uh, uh um they scored when they got the ball. They put up 28 points. Mm -hmm. They ran the football, but to, to give up the the amount of yards that the Falcons gave up with the amount of plays that Cleveland ran mm -hmm. and the amount of the time that they actually had the ball, mm -hmm. that's unbelievable. I mean, mm -hmm. 50 plays. Cleveland ran 50 plays. The Falcons had 73. And they gave up 427 yards on 50 plays, and they had the ball less than 30 minutes. Mm. Come on, Falcons. Y'all better than that. So Baker threw it 20 times, and he completed 17. That's Drew Brees-esque is what yeah. that is. And, and, what, and what did they have in common? Drew Brees got 47 rushes, 244 yards. Baker Mayfield got what, Jan? 29 for 211. Mm -hmm. You're right. When you run the ball... Mm. Doors open, mm. not windows. Mm. You don't ask him to do too much because in all the other starts, he's throwing it 30 plus times. Yep. Who's the lightning rod leader of the young Cleveland Browns? It's Baker <laughs> yeah. Mayfield. Yeah. Thank you very much. I got a problem with that. Yep. Yeah. Cleveland's, in, Cleveland's yeah. in good hands. They lost LeBron, but they got Baker. Right? Really? Yeah. Here I they bet, go. I bet they'd rather have LeBron back. Well, I hope so. Yeah, you hope. Well, <laughs> if he that guy, yeah, well, we'll see how that plays out. He ain't gonna be that. He's not gonna be that guy. Well, he might be a guy, but not that guy. Mm. I mean, they need they need a reincarnation of Jim Brown or Otto Graham. Mm. They can be up there with LeBron. Skip, come on. Mm. Maybe it can be Brian Sipe. I don't know. It was Brian Sipe. Didn't Brian Sipe win an MVP? Yeah. Cardiac yeah. kid. Yeah, yeah. So again, I'm not putting Baker in the Hall of Fame. I just say of this crop, that was the right pick. And they're making a lot of nice little choices, and they're building a good football what team. Good, what good is the crop if you don't like anything it bears? Mm. You know what I'm saying? I, I mean, I'm from the far side. You know, Jada had a little mm. farm growing up. You know, mm -hmm. peanuts, sweet mm -hmm. potatoes, mm -hmm. soybean. You know, all that kind of stuff, Skip. Okra, tomatoes. I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. Okay. Yeah. Do you, uh, do, can you do anything mm. besides talk? I can eat the food, but I can't make the food or grow the food. I don't know how to do that. That's what O'Shea come in handy. Yeah, yeah I mean, know him, yes. Mm. I know about all that kind of stuff. Mm. Hogs, cattle, crops, mm. yes. Mm. Chicken, yes, I do. Mm. Sure does. Oh. Way to go, Baker Mayfield. Are you on? You give up on no. Sam Darnold? He's not on yet. No? You still like Sam Darnold? You still think he's going to be the best of this crop? Skip, I don't love any of them. Oh, you don't love any of yeah. them? Yeah. So you're down on Sam Darnold? He didn't play yesterday, so I don't know oh, what to be right up now. and down. Oh, okay. I did see him on uh, opening. He opened somewhere, and yeah. they, they won. Yeah, yeah. they yeah, did. Wild. Skip, is, skip, is, skip is, he's a, these are rookie quarterbacks. Let's not set the bar. I mean, we tried to make them Drew Brees and Aaron Rodgers already. Mm. They, they're not Peyton Manning and Tom Brady. It's like, oh, come no. on. Can we, can we get it? Yeah. You know, it's feeling you, dangerous. Yeah, I yeah. woke up the same Dangerous. You know? <laughs> you know what? You know, I feel I dangerous. I see you got the pants suit on. You feel it real dangerous.
you know feel what? dangerous. I feel dangerous every morning when I wake up because I know what's sitting morning. across the table. Yeah, that's yeah, the it factor. Skip, Baker just Skip trying to come between us. I know, and you let him do it. Very well, good Baker job. is. You can join us. It's no. not a hard. Come on, no. Come on. It's more fun on this it's fun side. Over here. Mm -mm. Either way. All right. Uh, let's see about this. Let's talk <laughs> the NFC East. Are the Redskins running away with it? We'll discuss that. I don't know if you guys are. On